Today we visit the Waterloo Lake Park Cave. If you haven't seen it, haven't been here, we're gonna show you how to get there. My adventure buddy wore shorts and got tore up. <laughs> So we're at Waterloo Lake Park in Denison, Texas. You can see the Waterloo Lake in the background. You can actually go, I saw someone with a little canoe and you can go fishing in this lake as well. Right there is a cool little fountain you can walk over. And also there is a hiking trail that goes over this way. If you go down the hiking trail, you will go all the way you can see behind me, it actually goes all the way over on this shore and goes all the way around and we'll end up coming back here and up to where we are. We are parked at the main, at the main entrance, the big parking lot. That's where you can come in and park. And we're talking about the cave today. What my adventure buddy is leaving me is not, not following. Hey, adventure buddy, come here. Today, my adventure buddy is, who are you? Do you see any re resemblance? I'm your son. This is, this is my yeah. son, Keith. And Keith joins me today to walk out to the Waterloo Lake Park Cave, which is totally awesome, especially if you have not been there before. Let me show you how to get there. We're gonna zoom, zoom fast forward here in just a moment, um, but I do wanna show you if you're parked in the main parking lot where we are and you walk over here, this is the, this is north, and so you're going to walk, you can either walk all the way around, and when you get to the other side of the lake, you'll be at the little turnoff to go to the cave, but if you don't know that the turnoff's there, you'll miss it. Um, so we're actually gonna go down this path here, and we will meet you at the south side of the lake and show you where to turn off of the path to get to the cave, and then we'll take you down and show you the actual cave we're actually up on a hill, so this is a big kind of see the terrain that I'm that I'm on here. So this is normally the trail that you'd walk on, um, but there's also kind of a informal trail right here. We're up up a little bit just on this hill, so we're gonna walk along here. We, my adventure buddy, uh, we're gonna walk along this trail continue south, and then uh, we're gonna get down there, and I'll show you where the turnoff is to the cave. So we've made the trek down. You can see right behind my adventure buddy here. Um, we've made our walk all the way from way over here. We parked initially way over here and do 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 came to the southeast corner of the lake. We are actually, we are at the very end of the lake right here, southeast corner. And this is where your turnoff is. Now normally, you can see your trail right here. So if you're walking around the lake you would come out out here out of the trees and you would come and you would walk up here and this heads back to that main parking lot this is where the cutoff is so we're up on this big hill so you have to take this corner and you come up this hill and then we're gonna take you down you actually go over here where there's really not it sort of looks like a trail more looks like a Okay, so you might as well call this hill Big Bertha. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Uh, as you can see behind us, it's a pretty sizable hill, um, but the, the trail is actually um, looking much better. It actually looks like a trail now because we're leaving the, the weeded area, the grassy area. It's gonna be much nicer. Okay, one thing to note, it's been a little rainy here in North Texas and uh, wear appropriate shoes. For instance, uh, well, the nice thing is I don't have to wear sunglasses because other than that little bit of sunlight coming through the trees, it's a little bit cooler. We lost our breeze. It's still humid, but it's a lot cooler than baking out in the sun. Uh, but it is kind of gooey down here, so fortunately, uh, my adventure buddy and I brought, brought the right... Uh, Ah! Oh my lord, there's like Ooh. 15 mosquitoes on you. We're out. I'm 
Well, not only are there a lot of mosquitoes, but I don't know if you can see this right here. There is a big cobweb in the middle of the trail, so watch yourself. But we made it. Check this out. Ah, the bugs. So hopefully the bugs don't deter you from visiting. Uh, they've never been this bad from what I remember. It's a pretty sizable cave. It's not like just a little something that someone dug in the in the side of the hole, the side of the rock face here. He has a fairly deep space. One of the best things about this cave is it is so much cooler. It's just cool. It seems like it's not quite as humid out here in the cave, and it doesn't seem like the bugs are biting Speak for yourself. quite as much. Okay, so he just got almost carried away by a big mosquito. We kind of picked up the pace to get out of the tree covered area. I don't think we've ever had mosquitoes. I don't remember ever having mosquitoes. Uh, and if they were, they were so minimal, I don't remember them. But today, memorable. my adventure buddy wore shorts and got tore up. <laughs> Tore, 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 tore up. 